Alrighty guys, welcome back to my channel. I know you guys are probably tired of this look. Um, I have recorded three videos today and they all have been in this look. So, I, I mean, I don't know about you guys, but I love it. So I'm not tired of looking at it, but if you are. <laughs> so today we're gonna do uh, something different. It's called, I've been seeing it like a lot on YouTube. It's called an anti-haul. Creator of it was, let me see, I just had it up. Kimberly Clark, I'm gonna link her video down below so you guys can check her channel out. Um, but it's basically a haul where you talk about the things that you will not be purchasing. And I don't think you're, you're not bashing the company or anything. You're just saying that there's some items in particular that you won't be spending your money. I've been seeing anti um, makeup hauls. I've been seeing anti natural hair hauls. So today I'm gonna do an anti plus size haul. Stay tuned. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and click the little bell button at the bottom of the um, video so that you get notifications for every time I post. Okay, so uh, like I said, it's gonna be a, I'm gonna do the plus size version of the anti haul, and I'm gonna start out with my beloved Torrid. So I love, I'm gonna start off by saying I love Torrid, love Torrid love Torrid. We're currently wearing two out of three pieces uh, from Torrid. I just, I've been having issues with them. You know what I'm saying? Like, I remember back in the day and I'm not like, I'm saying that like I'm like you know, old or something, but I've been wearing Torrid for a very long time. And I remember back in the day when everything was like edgy and you know, sculled out and you know, just dark. So I guess they turned over a whole new leaf and everything is light and sunshine and bubbles and flowers. Which I have no issue with, you know, it appeals to my inner, you know, uh, flower child, you know. It makes me want to recycle. <laughs> but no. So there's been a couple of items that I've seen on this latest release and I'm just like, no. No. Um, my issue with Torrid is that they'll have something that is a, a nice cut, you know, it looks nice on the body, it wears nice for everybody, and they'll release it in one color or one pattern, and then the following season, they'll release it again in a different pattern and a different color. Fool me one time. Fool me one time. Um, so for example, I'm sorry, it's a shadow jersey body con dress basically. It's this dress right here. I have this dress on right now in gray. And when it first came out, I was like, oh, I wish it came out in black. Oh, I wish I had it in black. And I'm, you know, sitting there like, oh, you know, I'm mad and stuff because like I said before in my shoe haul, I am a creature of hat. I'll link my shoe haul down below. But I love to purchase things. Like if I like something and I like the cut and I like the style, I'm gonna buy it in every color, especially if it looks good on me, because it's really hard to find clothes that, you know, look nice and fit well and are budget friendly. Um, so this dress, like I said, I bought this last year, and of course this year they come out with the black version of the dress. I will not be buying it. Of course this year they come out with the black version of the dress. I will not be buying it. <laughs> So the next item is these uh, buckle stripe sandals. Uh, I'm sorry, buckle strap sandals from Torrid. What? No, like no, no. I mean, it, it might look good on some other people, but I just won't. They, they just don't look good, you know, and it, it'd be different if it look, it doesn't even look good on a model. And I have this thing where I'm like, if it doesn't look good on a model, then it's definitely not going to look good on me. They have so, so many nice shoes at their store. I, I just wouldn't see myself in, in these. So I won't be buying that item as well. So the next item, I'm mad. So the next item is this um, 
like bell sleeve dress. Everybody was like dying about it last year. It every I remember it came out last year, uh, same cut but different pattern. So it came out last year and when I say I died when I couldn't get it when it first came out, I died. So it came out again and I was able to get my hands on it and I'm like, oh, I wish it came out in black. And lo and behold, they released it in black and they released it in this color right here. So I'm like, for all those reasons, I'm not purchasing it. No. that you're gonna release it in black or a basic color then release all the basic colors and then release the prints you know what I'm saying like just have it all available so I can be like you know what I want this print I want that print and cuz like I said I'm crazy I will buy something the same exact thing in a different color that's just how I am because like I said if I like it and if it's nice and it looks nice then that's what I'm gonna do but don't try to trick me. <laughs> don't try to trick me. Y'all see that? This, I'm going to post a picture of me in this exact same dress, just a different pattern. Don't try to trick me. I'm not falling for it. I'm not buying it. <laughs> so the next item is a Torrid swimsuit. Y'all, like, when I say... I'm mad, like, I, ugh, I just, I can't with them right now, like, I have issues with them right now, like, I bought this swimsuit, I bought it in white, cause I'm like, ooh, I wanna look holier than thou, but if it came in black, that would be good too, and I would've bought it. So you release it next year? <laughs> I'm just, I bought it, but still. <laughs> Stop playing with my emotions. Just release all the basic colors, the blacks, the browns, the reds, and the, the grays. Just release them all at once and then add your patterns in between. Because you have like a spring release, a hall, a summer release. Like release the basic colors first and then come out with the patterns. Because then I might decide, you know. Because I'm not really a pattern person. Uh, like right now I have on like a gray dress and a blue jean jacket. I, don't, I, I rarely ever accessorize. Um, that's just not my thing. I don't like things dangling from me. I don't like, you know, I might put, throw some earrings every now and then, but I'm more into like my makeup. So, so I'll, I'll, I'm not really like an accessory person, but I will accessorize. Well, I'm learning to accessorize. If you're gonna release black the next season, the, the, like you, Black and white go together for me. Black and white go together. So why would you not release the black and the white together? That's just, am I the only one? I bought it, but I'm, I'm just mad about it. So this, I shouldn't have included this because I actually bought it, but I just want to let y'all know I'm salty. salty. So the next item is not a Tory item. It's actually a Lane Bryant item. And I actually bought it. <laughs> so it was these wide whip sandals that I got from Lane Bryant. Sunglasses I too. So it was these sandals. And I, I just did a shoe haul and I was explaining how I like sturdy sandals. I like sturdy shoes because I'm a, you know, I'm a big girl. I like for my shoes to be able to hold me. I don't want to feel like I'm slipping and falling. I don't want to feel like I'm busting loose. That's just me. So when I bought these shoes, I'm just like, oh, they, you know, my, and also my feet aren't really wide. So I usually size down at like Lane Bryant or Tour because they make, like, I guess they assume that because you're fat, you have fat feet. And I don't, I actually wear like some, some shoes I can get away with wearing a 12 narrow because my feet are like really skinny, but they're just long. They look like, um, Subway sandwiches. <laughs> I bought these from Lane Bryant and I bought them because I don't have any white sandals. But I regret buying them and I'm taking these back because first of all, the strap across here, I feel like I'm too, you know how like, like little kids just have Velcro straps and all this crazy stuff. So I was just like, I'm over the strap. It doesn't look good. And then the shoes were really, really wide. Um, like I said before, I feel like they 
assume that because you're bigger or you're larger that you wear that you have wide feet and that's the case for most people but not for all um, so for those reasons I, I was literally slipping and sliding these shoes like I, I've tried them I don't I don't like trying things on in the store but I will if I have to but usually I just you know take them home you know try them on in my house in my setting but I didn't do that and I was slipping like I was and the shoes sliding sideways. And I actually sized down. This is actually a 10. And like I said, I usually wear an 11 to a 12. And this was a 10 and I was sliding. So for that reason, that's why these shoes are going back. So the next item is from Ashley Stewart. I was kind of sad, you know. I I wanted these to work. I, I, I purchased this item as well. And it's going back as well. I wanted these these to work. Um, I feel like Ashley Stewart is really known for having their their accessories to par. You know what I'm saying? Like they have the best necklaces, bracelets. You know, you can get a nice bodycon from them. Definitely some gladiator sandals. But they they missed the mark on these. Uh, I thought these were going to be like reflective they're not like they just they look like a, a blues player's glasses <laughs> they're like really big and they're heavy um i don't know if you can see just oh, my face looks crazy i've literally been in this all day like i said i recorded like four videos today this is my fourth video but um yeah like they were these are I, I want them to be lighter than what they were. I want them to be reflective on the outside. Like you can see, you know, my setup because it's glasses. But I, they, I thought they were gonna be like mirrors or something, and they weren't. So they're going back. Um, I don't know about you guys, but I feel like Lane Bryant. Like when I hear that, I, I hear bras and panties. Like they have, in my opinion, the best bras and panties. Period. Like, can't touch. So, they're, they're a little pricey, but I feel like they're worth it. I've had some of their bras for like up to five years and they're phenomenal. Um, my bra size is a 46 triple D, so I need like some, some support. And I bought this bra, I think it was called the uh, Plunge Bra, and the, I, I took the straps down because it was like, digging in my skin but I feel like that bra should not have been made for anybody over a, a cup size C because the plunge bra the way it's set up it's like it, it's not like okay here's your underwear under your boobs it's set up towards like almost up to the side so I was wearing the bra and every time I raised my arms up and put them down my bra would creak it sounded like I was closing the door it was just embarrassing uh, and I never had any issues with their bras before. I usually wear like a balconette or, um, you know, I, I just never go for a plunge. Or if I do, it's a smooth plunge. And I think that was the reason. Because I got a t-shirt plunge this time. But, um, I took that bra back. Like, y'all not finna. Them bras is like $40, $50 a pop. You're not about to play me. I sounded like a door. Like, creaking when I when I put my arms down in the bra like in the middle it sounded like it was rubbing together so I don't know if it was a defect on the bra but I will not be purchasing that specific that specific bra ever again and lastly I have an item that I actually purchased that I cannot take back should have tried it on in the store this item is from lovesick Lovesick is a is like um, the Torrid Baby Store or like Torrid's Little Sister Store. They are currently going out of business. I think they're having a sale up to 80% off, I believe. 80 to 90% off the entire store. And I picked up uh, some Torrid, like uh, I don't know what's going on, but I guess they're sending their Torrid items to Lovesick to be sold, like clearance down, just, you know, just to get rid of the stuff. But, um, so I went there a couple weeks ago and I bought these shorts. Now, they say Torrid, 
but I bought them at Lovesick. And these are the flowy lace shorts. They were originally $38. I think I paid $4 for them. And we all know $4 at tour is like, you can't even get lip gloss. Um, so I bought these shorts because I, I thought like, I don't know what I was thinking, like they could be like a high waist or something. And they have like this pretty lace detail at the bottom. And like, I was like, okay, so my butt ain't gonna be hanging out. But when I tried them on, they look like a diaper. Like I look like baby Jesus. Ugh, like I thought it was gonna look like a skirt. I thought it was gonna be more like flowy. No, like it looked like it separated my stomach and it made it look like I had a butt in the front and in the back. Uh, I don't know if it was the material. I don't know if it was the actual, you know, because they're so long. Like I, Jesus, like they're so long. I, and then they don't have pockets. Oh, wait, I take that back. They do have pockets. They have pockets. But still, like, they were not flattering. I'm gonna insert a picture of me in these shorts. Maybe I'm not, because I don't want y'all to see me like that. It was just not, it wasn't. And then they have pleats right at the top around where your belly is. It's supposed to pull you in, but it ain't doing nothing but uh, decorating your belly. So, unfortunately, I have to keep this item, but I wish I didn't buy it. <laughs> but I think that is all for today. I had a little, I had a little too much fun. Uh, I think I, mm, like I said, I have nothing but love for tour. Like, um, I got on tour right now. I got two bags over there. I'm about to do a tour haul and. 2.5 seconds but it's just if you're gonna be rep like I just feel like I'm being tricked hoodwink bamboozled I'm just I just don't y'all know y'all know me like I said I will buy it if the uh, if the other colors are available I I just did a shoe haul four pairs of shoes was almost the same for this anti-haul. I think I had a little bit too much fun with this haul. I don't know, it brought out my inner dark side. But I hope you like it. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you in my next tutorial. Bye!